here with Coach Josh Staley from Orangeburg Wilkerson. Coming off the way last year ended, just what it is going to take to finally get over that hump and in some ways to prove Coach Stroman wrong? I mean, we're not going to put any stock into the way last year ended because you got to look at the whole journey. Like that one game is not going to, we're not going to allow that one game to define all the work these young ladies put in to get to that point. Did we want to win the game? Yes. But at the same time, we had a successful year and we're going to build on that and continue to do the things that we've been doing and um, find the areas we need to improve on and work from there. Well, you sort of went through the same thing the year before and you were able to get back to that point. So from the journeys you've learned the last couple of years, what's the one thing you think you have to do better to do one better? We're going to, we're going to master the mental aspect. Sometimes when you're dealing with sports, the majority of the time, it's not so much physical. So now we're getting better mentally understanding the work that we put in is the reason why we're here and believing in getting the um, job done. You know, it's going to take it one step at a time. DeJoria coming off a knee injury, just how she looked in practice and can she get back to the level she was before the injury? She's, she's probably already past the level she, she was before the injury. She's, she's not at that level anymore. She's a much better player. She's having the basketball. Um, she has an explosiveness back, so she's looking really good. So we're excited about getting her back on the court. Don't have Nabrisha, so who's going to really fill that void? Well, you know, we're doing it by committee. Um, Sade Johnson has really stepped up. You know, she's shooting the ball a lot better. Um, she's attacking more. So we've had some kids um, this, um, stepping in that role already, and um, they're looking pretty good. At your point, just with um, Zaria sharing time with Mitchell, just how is that working? That's a beautiful thing because we have two point guards who know the system extremely well. Um, they're very consistent. They're, they're at practice every day. They're at workouts every day. So they're exactly what a coach would want in their point guard. So they're doing a great job. Just last year um, with your bench, just you had a lot of young big girls last year. Just how they tried to, how did they develop? They've come around um, a whole lot. Like Jaquana Mary has um, basically over 10 scholarship offers now. You know, she's come around. Um, Shay Jackson's doing a great job. Aaron Hauser is doing tremendous right now. So everybody, all the work that was put in, they're really coming around and doing a great job. Amari Grievous is a lot better. So we're really excited about the young kids. Well, I guess you heard what Coach Stroman had to say. Just does that sort of add even more motivation to get back to getting to Columbia? For it's, all, it's, all, it's all in good sportsmanship. We definitely didn't take that personally. It was funny, it was cute, but at the end of the day, when we lace up our shoes, we're going to come at them just as hard as they come at us, and um, we'll live with whatever happens. And